Tamamdır. Bende bir şey oldu yani. Hello and welcome to the HMMT Spring 2021 award ceremony. My name is Lauren. And I'm Christine. And we were the 2020 to 2021 season tournament directors. Before we announce the winners, the uh, winners of HMMT Spring 2021, we wanted to thank you all for attending HMMT's first ever virtual ranked tournament. Um, there were many ups and downs along the way, but we appreciate your flexibility throughout the weekend, and we hope you had fun. HMMT is a huge undertaking every year, and with the abrupt transition to a new normal, this tournament season was certainly no exception. So we wanted to give our thanks to all the staff, officers, and volunteers who helped from the logistical side, and who made events with as many moving parts as the Friday night events, Saturday live proctoring, and Sunday education events come together. We also wanted to thank all of the members of our problems team who wrote and graded every problem from guts number one to team round number 10. The incredible software team who built all of our infrastructure from scratch and worked tirelessly so that we could quick quickly transition to a virtual tournament setting. Um, another shout out to all of the guest teachers and our featured speaker, Dr. Poshen Lo, for preparing fascinating lectures that helped expand our horizons beyond com competition math. And of course, our student competitors for your patience, understanding and unwavering energy, even with our various technical difficulties. And of course, your willingness to even participate in our first online tournament. And last but certainly not least, we wanted to thank coaches and parents for helping and encouraging your students along the way. Um, before we move on, we also wanted to thank our sponsors for supporting HMMT and making this event possible. And with that, we will get started with the winners. So before we announce any of the tournament winners, we wanted to start with announcing the giveaway winners that we had for our Friday night events and Sunday a education class attendees. So to start, the two winners from our Friday night events giveaway were Varun T from St. Mark's, Texas and Holden M from No Coast, Best Coast. And then the two winners from our Sunday education raffle or giveaway was Eric B from Westchester Area Alpha and Evelina Z from Olympiads. We will be in contact with your giveaway winnings shortly. Now, without further ado, we'll start with the individual rounds. First up in algebra and number theory, we have in ninth place with a score of 31.67, uh, a tie for Andrew L, Daniel H, Hoya L, Jessica W, Kai W, and Regan C. In eighth place, with a score of 33.86, we have Thomas F. In fifth place, with another tie, uh, with a score of 38.08, we have Ankit B, Maxim L, and Maximus L. In fourth place with a score of 40.23 is Linus T. In third place with a score of 42.25 is Derek L. And in first place, we have a tie uh, with a score of 46.65. Congratulations to Brian L and Luke R. Congratulations, we will be in touch with your awards and prizes. Okay, next up in the individual rounds is the geometry round. So first up we have, with a score of 30.59, a huge tie for fourth place, 
We have Adam T, Alex H, Alexander X, Brian L, Daniel X, Edward Y, Eric S, Holden M, Jessica W, Karthik B, Maximus L, Noah W, Samuel W, Thomas S, and Timothy Q. In third place with a score of 33.92, we have Derek L. In second place with a score of 38.08, we have Daniel H. And finally, with a score of 47.65, we have Luke R in first place. Congratulations to all of our geometry round winners. We will be in contact with your prizes and awards shortly. Last up in the, in the individual round awards is combinatorics. Uh, to start us off, in eighth place, once again, we have a tie um, with a score of 27.24. Uh, we have Ankit B, Eric S, Sanjana D, Timothy Q, and William W. Next in seventh place with a score of 27.39, we have Zani X. In sixth place with a score of 30.58, we have Taiga N. And in fourth place with a score of 34.67, uh, we have a tie with Derek L and Huaya L. In third place with a score of 34.88, we have Ro Chen Z. In second place with a score of 39.25, we have Reagan C. And in first place with a score of 49.65, congratulations to Luke R. Um, again, we will be in touch with your awards and prizes. And with that, we will move on to the team rounds. So first up is the team round. And in 10th place, we had, with a score of 337, YEA Spice. Um, in ninth place, we had, with a score of 355, Lehigh Valley Fire. In eighth place, with a score of 366, Florida Alligators. With a score of 428, we had Texas Momentum A in seventh place. With a score of 469, we had Washington Gold One in sixth place. With a score of 472, we had San Diego A1 in fifth place. With a score of 480, we had Pentagon, Hexagon, Oregon in a in fourth place. And with a score of 514, we had Alpha Star Academy Air in third place. With a score of 515, we had Tin Man in second place. And finally, with a score of 591, we had Motown All Stars A as the first place team run winner. Congratulations to all of the teams that placed. Um, so before we move on to the Guts winner, which is next up, we wanted to share a really quick story. So I'm sure many of you are waiting to hear what the answer was to number 33 on the Guts round. Uh, for context, for those of you that didn't take the contest, this was the first estimation question on our Guts round this year, and it asked for an estimate of the smallest positive integer that was not used as an answer by any of the teams or individuals on any of the rounds today, including the Guts round and the specific question. So the question itself is a little bit contradictory, which made it tricky to answer, because if your team guessed exactly the smallest number up to that point, that would no longer be a number that hasn't been used as an answer. So the final answer ended up being 139. However, before the guts round, the answer had actually been 71, which is really close to another number that we frequently get uh, as a guess to contest questions. But unfortunately, one team guessed 71 for question 33. Um, and so the, ended, the answer ended up moving up to 139, which made it so that a lot of teams didn't get points. But we thought we, you would enjoy that story. <laughs> so without further ado then, uh, let's move on to the Guts winners with a score of 232 in 10th place is Florida Alligators. With a score of 233, tied for eighth place, we have Lexington Alpha and Thomas Jefferson High School for Science, Science and Technology B. With a score of 256 in seventh place is San Diego A1. 
with a score of 260 in sixth place is No Coast Best Coast. With a score of 264 in fifth place is Tin Man. With a score of 266 in fourth place is Lehigh Valley Fire. With a score of 272 in third place is Alpha Star Academy Air. With a score of 314 in second place is Motown All Stars A. And finally, with a score of 360 in first place is Texas Momentum A. Congratulations to all of our winners. And again, we'll be in touch about the prizes. So with that, we will be, be announcing overall team and overall individual winners, participants and teams who excelled across the board. We will start off with the top individuals. So in 10th place, we had, with a score of 82.01, Noah W. from Pentagon, Hexagon, Oregon, A. And in ninth place, we had, with a score of 82.08, Jessica W. from Florida Alligators. With a score of 83.01, we had Eric S. from Alpha Star Academy Air in eighth place. With a score of 84.28, we had Maximus L. from Induction Over the Alphabet in seventh place. With a score of 86.22, we had Kwai L. from Lexington Alpha in sixth place. With a score of 90.74, we had Reagan C. from Motown All Stars A in fifth place. With a score of 91.7, uh, we had Ankit B from San Diego A1 in fourth place. With a score of 104.42, we had Brian L from Lehigh Valley Fire in third place. The score of 111.14, we had Derek L from San Diego A1 in second place. And finally, with a score of 143, Point nine six. we had Luke R from Texas Momentum A in first place. Congratulations to all of our top individuals. We will be in contact with your prizes shortly. Great job. So before we announce the sweepstakes winners, we'd like to discuss an aspect of HMMT will be changing for the next season. Uh, so we will be changing the top 40 policy. Uh, for those of you who might not know, the top 40 policy grants the top 40 sweepstakes winners uh, automatic acceptance to the same tournament the following year. So in order to accommodate more teams through the registration lottery, the HMNT organizing team has decided to change the top 40 policy to grant automatic acceptances to fewer teams. Um, furthermore, we are also eliminating the policy entirely for the November tournament. Um, so all spots in the November tournament from now on will be lotteried. Um, well, without further ado, the moment that we've all been waiting for, the sweepstakes winners. Um, in 10th place, uh, with a score of 1,137.14, uh, Pentagon, Hexagon, Oregon, A. In ninth place, with a score of 1,151.73, Lexington, Alpha. In eighth place, with a score of 1,202.59, Florida, Alligators. In seventh place, with a score of 1,253.73, Washington Gold won. In sixth place, with a score of 1,262.19, Lehigh Valley Fire. In fifth place, with a score of 1,309.34, Texas Momentum A. In fourth place, with a score of 1,317.58, San Diego A1. And in third place with a score 1,321.11, a nice number, Tin Man. In second place with a score of 1,448.79, Alpha Star Academy Air. And finally in first place with a score of 1,548.89, Motown All Stars A. Um, congratulations to all of our winners. Uh, again, we'll be in contact for your awards and prizes. And um, thank you again to all of our participants. Um, this competition would not have been possible without all of your enthusiasm for mathematics and for HMMT. Before we send everyone off, we wanted to uh, plug 
two quick reminders. T-shirts for the this uh, current competition are available to be ordered at link.humt.org slash shirts. This order form will be open until Monday and you'll be able to order the T-shirts to yourselves. We also have a feedback form that we would really appreciate if you could fill out at link.humt.org slash feedback. We will also be sending this uh, information out in an email, but if you could give us a few comments just about your experience, it would really help us create an even better competition uh, virtually or in person in future years. Um, so once again, on behalf of the organizing team, we want to thank you so much uh, for coming to HMMT Spring this year. Um, detailed results and solutions to contest problems will be posted on our website in the next couple of weeks. And we hope to see you again next year. And, you know, we hope that you're able to stay safe wherever you are in the world. Um, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming and we hope you enjoyed it. Bye. And congratulations again.